Students are getting back at the classroom, and while a new school year can be exciting, it can also be very stressful. Yeah, the anxiety typically fades for most kids as the year goes on, but parents can help their kids manage their stress and anxiety throughout the year. Dr. Sabrina Renteria, a child and adolescent board certified psychiatrist at Cedar sinai is joining us with some important information for parents. Good morning, doctor. Good morning. Good morning. This is so timely. A lot of parents are experiencing right, uh, all of this right now. So we want to ask you, what are some of the stressors that students are dealing with today? So some of the stressors going back to school can be fear and anxiety about that first day, um, worries about, you know, friend groups and simple things like how do I find the bathroom? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And so what are some of the things that parents can help do to alleviate some of those stressors or address some of the many issues that could come up? I think the most important thing is talking with your child before that first day, checking in just to see what are the biggest fears they might be facing because what we think is going to be stressful might be different than what they are thinking is stressful. Um, also, maybe going through that first day in the routine where do you catch the bus for school? Where are the bathrooms? What's the layout of your classroom? And possibly even checking in with the teacher. And also just acknowledging some of their feel, fears and validating them can be really helpful for students. Yeah, and Sabrina, back to school, you know, stress is understandable that back to school, the first week jitters, mm -hmm. right? Uh, but how yeah. long should parents be monitoring their children's stress, you know, before they actually look for professional help? So, you know, as a parent, you know your child better than anyone. I think that time range varies just based off of your understanding of your of your child. I would give it a few weeks for the most part. Um, but if you notice that your child is showing really severe changes, like they're more irritable, tearful, extremely anxious, and maybe not even wanting to go to school, mm -hmm. that can be a trigger for you to seek the help of a, a professional. That makes sense, and parents know their kids best, so they just have to pay attention and monitor them. Dr. Renteria, thank you so much for joining us for this conversation. Thank you.